today I'm gonna take you guys along on my get ready with me. And the first thing that I do is I use um, my Cloud Care Weightless Whipped Moisturizer from Agency. I am a proud partner with Agency. I've uh, worked with them in the past and I'm a huge fan of their products. They're specially designed and created for you and your skin type. So that definitely helps. Next, I always, always apply sunscreen. Black Girl Sunscreen. No, this is not a paid affiliation or paid partnership, but it could be. <laughs> I wear sunscreen every day. Every day. Winter, spring, summer, fall. I hope that you are wearing sunscreen as well. Especially with aging skin. You know, we're all fighting a good fight. Trying to keep it as plump, wrinkle-free as possible. All right, so after I've prepped my skin, now I'm, I'm by no means a professional. I do things a little unorthodox. I do them in my own way, so I'm just taking you along. So first I'm gonna do my brows, which I use the lip bar. Another proud partnership collaboration that I enjoyed working with and look to do some more in the future and i fill in my brows my brows are pretty pretty thick pretty full for you know for the most part i go get them threaded maybe every six weeks sometimes every eight weeks and I will just fill them in, or if I have a little hair, I'll tweeze. So, super simple. Oh, see, I have that problem. It looks like one is heavier than the other. So, I go back over. And this is hard, so hold on, I'm gonna look in the mirror. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> These get ready with me's. Oh my goodness. But I know, I know, I know. People want to see, they want to know. So, hey, I get a lot of questions in my DM about my simple, basic beat. And it is simple, it is basic. Anybody can do it. I'm not a makeup artist. Um, I don't wear a ton of makeup, I wear just a little. But of course, when I'm doing a photo shoot, they, you know, you gotta put on a little bit more. So that works too. All right, so after I've done my eyeliner, and oh, I do, I keep my things, I'm pretty, you know, I keep my things in a little organizer like this with all of my eye things, uh, mascaras, and then I have my, you see, you see, you see, you see, you see who I rock, right? The lip bar. And also worked on a campaign in the past, oh my God, with uh, Thrive Cosmetics. This mascara, Whew. that's why I don't do false lashes. I don't need to. Okay, and then for my other things that I use, I keep them in the nice case here. It's nice for travel. Keep all of the things nice and organized because that's just how I am. That's how I keep my life together. And it's great for travel. Has a nice little flip up there for all your brushes. And this is on Amazon, in my Amazon store or something similar because I got it from Amazon a few years ago. All right, so now that you've seen the things I use, let's get started. So I always start with my, uh -oh, my skin tint by the lip bar and I wear Honey Dip. In the winter, I wear Honey Dip. In the summer, I wear... Almond Joy. It's 
got a little bit more melanin in it because my skin has a little bit more melanin in it. So it definitely works for me in the summer, the uh, Almond Joy. But during the colder months, I wear Honey Dip. It's really a perfect match. Um, I just squeeze a little bit on my cheek, my trouble area there, my chin. Um, when I was 16, no, 15, I got uh, a really bad case of chicken pox. And as a result, I keloided. And for those who are of color, you know what keloids are. They're permanent scars, they're over healing. And so I'm such a good healer. I heal so well. <laughs> I heal so well that it left permanent scars on my chin. So it's always been a very sensitive um, subject for me as I've grown up with it. Um, seems to bother me more than it bothers anyone else, but at 54, it doesn't bother me anymore <laughs> because um, I still look good. <laughs> all right, so then I just take, as you can see, I go all around and I only use the dot, 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 dot. All right, next up, I will take a little bit of highlighter just because, uh oh, I got a little hair there from that brush. I use the uh, Quick Conceal in Cinnamon. Quick Conceal by Lip Bar in Cinnamon. And I take that and I kind of go like just a little around there. And I don't even do this every day, but I am getting ready to go out. So I'll put a little bit more on. Oh my God. Okay. And then I just go down there and I actually do put a little on the trouble spots that I have there. So, you know, that's my only complaint. Other than that, I'm pretty happy with my skin, you know? About to be double nickels in the summer. Yes. Uh, not bad, you know? I'm gonna take the little beauty blend. And then I just kind of go all around in a circular motion. I never tug too much on my skin because the tugging is not good. And um, yeah, you just, you don't want to tug. And as you can see, I'm just kind of fanning all out with the leftover. I don't leave anything behind. Because this stuff is expensive. Makeup, skincare, beauty routine. So I use every little bit. All right, so after I've done that, I take my little fast face from the lip bar. Um, yeah, I, I use it every day. And I take the uh, end of the brush there and I put on the face powder all over. Even down on the neck area because the beautiful thing about the lip bar is that the products don't come off on your skin because it's not like a true foundation. It's a skin tint and it just gives you a nice tint. So as you can see, even without doing anything else, if I wanted to leave the house, put on a little gloss, I'm good. But um, I'm going to do a little bit more. I'm going to do some I Hold on, let's see. Okay, I'm back. So I use my Prep and Prime, which is the 24 hour eye base. And this is by MAC. Another brand I've been using since I was uh, in college. Hey Mac, college girl. <laughs> um, yeah, so I take a little bit, literally just, just that much. And that goes for both. Because like I said, I don't really wear a lot of um, shadow, but just enough. And then I just pat it on. So, yeah, let that kind of dry a little bit. 
while that's drying. Next, I take um, blush. So this is another, this was gifted, Trustique. Love their products. It's great, um, sustainable, reusable, um, refillable. They refill it, um, comes in a cute little bag. So yeah, um, gifted and love it. So holla at your girl, Trustee. Let's get it popping. <laughs> cute isn't it this is the blush and this is saint bart's pink and i take the blush and i go up like that i don't really put it on the ball of the cheek because it seems to lift me my face a little bit more when I do it like that. And then at the other end, it has this cute little brush and I just kind of blend that up. So you see, it's giving me a little bit, just what I need. Little rouge and rosy cheeks, but not too much. Okay, so there, done with that. And then next, now that the eyes are all dry, I use my MAC palette. I've had this for ooh, probably way too long, but I love the colors because they're basic, they're neutral. Um, I use, obviously, you see what's out, the, the neutrals, the chocolates, the creamy colors, and um, the burgundy. So I go in with the base of that. there but barely not there like does she have makeup on or doesn't she we don't know that's the beauty of my natural beauty not for everybody what's for me is for me Then I take this part of the brush because that, that's the flat part that I use and then I use the little brushy brush part and I go in I use the chocolate one and okay this is what I do I go up in an upward mo motion almost going like to the top of the corner of my brow I like the way it kind of contours like gives an illusion like I did something, but I really didn't do too much. You see what I mean? Just a little something, something. And then next, which I forgot to do, so I do take a little bit of the quick conceal and I put it under the arch. Just a little bit. And then I take a real flat brush tip and just kind of, yeah, you see, you get it. See that? Simple, but you see the difference? Like just a little bit. That, that's it, just a little bit. Okay, next I take from the same Fast Face palette, um, I take a little bit of the bronzer and I take that with the top part of this and I go right at the tip and I just kind of go above where I put the blush just so when I'm taking my photos and oh yeah, I put a little bit on my nose there. You know, the light bounces off where it's supposed to bounce off. Once again, I am not a professional. I'm just doing me. All right, so the next thing I do, because I don't always do liner, I probably wear eyeliner maybe twice a week. And if I'm like going out somewhere special, but um, no. 
don't know. Let me try. Let me see. Okay. And it's liquid. So I've been trying to work on this wing. But hold on. Let's see. You know who has the greatest wing tip? The, the wing eye? Uh, Jackie uh, from New York City. Jackie. I, I love her. And her eyes. I, I gotta ask her how she does that. So I do know that one of my co-workers told me to start center and she's a beauty and then she said wing my way out uh, oof. I don't know. I'm myself in the eye. and I have contacts in but yeah I do see the difference this other one. Oh, and I don't like to pull and tug on my skin, so very gentle and lightly. And then I pull it out. I think. Oh, see, I probably messed this one up. Oh, girl. <laughs> I need help with the wingtip. Oh, doing it myself. Help me. I need a tutorial. I just never I, I don't know but for the purposes of this video um, this is gonna have to do okay next up I will apply my mascara which I said is the liquid lash extensions mascara I use from Thrive I worked on a campaign with them back in the winter or actually it was summer of last year and this is the truth so let's go in i usually rub it across and then fan it out and you know what something else i've been thinking about everybody's been getting and you know these med spas <laughs> even my dentist's office is offering Botox and I'm not opposed to it I just haven't done it yet but I'm just wondering what's what's everybody's take on that how do you feel about it would you do it have you done it does it work for you do you see the difference these lashes mm -hmm. I told you look at that boom cool yeah it's, it's amazing my makeup artist even asked me where did you get that I love it I said girl what are perks of being an influencer <laughs> As my sister says, an influencer in the crazy world of social media. Still getting used to it, still navigating. And um, do a little bit on the bottom. Yeah, yeah. The, the lashes, the lashes are lashes. Okay, lashes, done. All right, so um, another thing that I use from Thrive Cosmetics is their Brilliant Eye Brightener. So um, this was also a part of the campaign and it really does make your eyes just Come alive. It's the little inner corners there that you hit. Mm -hmm. You know. Makes all 
the difference. And some you can put it under, um, or you can just leave it like I do. I don't tend to do it any more than that unless, you know, I'm going somewhere super, super special or photo shoot. All right, so done with that, done with that. Now, it's just time for a lip. So, what lip? I think I'm gonna do my basic lip that everybody loves, so hold tight. Okay, before I do my lips, I always use my Lano Lips. This 101 ointment, mm, white, I'm sorry, multi balm coconutter. It's everything. It is great nourishment for your lips. I honestly put this on. And be done and go out the door. Lano lips. But today I am going to do my full natural beat face. So I'm gonna go in now uh, with my straight facts smudge proof lip liner. And then I'll top it off with Fly Girl. One of my sister friends, she calls me that. She's like, hey, Fly Girl. I'm like, girl, that's what I got on today. I wear every hair day. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. See? Look at that. There you have it. Face is beat and I am ready to get my outfit on. Super casual. Girls are getting together. Um, some dear friends of mine I've known literally my entire life since I was 18. And we travel together and we're actually gonna be meeting up to plan um, another girl's getaway. So it's a color themed party so I've got purple I'm bringing purple things and then another friend's bringing orange things you know brown so I've got purple and it should be a lot of fun so I love my friends my sister friends they're they're the best so fly girl I think I need a little bit more So you all let me know what you think in the comments, if I should do more. I'm dipping my little feet in the pond um, of YouTube, so I would love to hear what you guys think and if I should continue and do more. You know, I love my fashion. I love uh, styling things for you guys. I'm a thrifter, a consignment shopper, traveler, and all things pretty later. Remember, you guys have got to let me know if you want to see more, I'll create more. Um, yeah, I think, I think I might like it here. All right, good people. I will chat with y'all later. Bye.